Right, joined by striker Liam Nash, um, previewing Saturday's game against Slough. Firstly, Liam, you've only been here a week. Um, how are you finding life at the Ducks so far? Yeah, no, it's really, it's really good. The uh, the players have um, welcomed me in. I've settled in very well. Um, feel uh, not comfortable because I'm not comfortable wherever you go on a new new player. But yeah, I've settled in. I've settled in nice, and the, the lads are top draw. And yeah, feel feel very comfortable at the club. Yeah, you you come with a, a really good pedigree. Um, you scored lots of goals at Morden. Um, that obviously propelled you into the football league at, at local club Gillingham. Um, being back local. Dartford wise, um, are you finding it more more at home? Because obviously you was over in Ireland for a little bit. Yeah, yeah, no. Obviously, I went over to Ireland after my um, spell at Gillingham. Um, needed to get some confidence back. Um, and yeah, no, it, it definitely does feel. It feels like a homely club. Um, you know, the people here are great. Um, like I said, I've, I've been very welcomed at the club, and yeah, it is closer to home as well, which is always nice. Um, I do have to go over the bridge, <laughs> but um, yeah, no. Other than that, it is it's a very homely club and very happy to be here. Yeah, we um, obviously the move come about that you were released by Hemel. Being top goal scorer at Hemel, it was a little bit weird, um, but we're obviously excited to have you here, aren't we? So, I mean, yeah, I can't, I can't say too much on it because uh, it is what it is. But you know, at the end of the day, I was happy at Hemel. And, you know, when you're not wanted somewhere, that's it. And at the end of the day, I've decided to, you know, look at my options. And, and thankfully, uh, the gaffer was interested. And, you know, I did have um, my sights on Dartford. I knew how big of a club they were. And, you know, the ground and the stadium is um, it's probably one of the best in the league, if I'm honest. Um, the whole setup, um, where they want to go with the club. Um, yeah, it just, um, yeah, it really excited me. So it was a very, you know, Direct club that I wanted to go to, yeah. Um, yeah, we talked about the fan base. Is it? I mean, we saw Saturday and, and previous games that we're getting well over a thousand people here. Is that something that interests players like yourself? That you're looking at that fan base, certainly this level, that that for people like yourself to, to come and play for? I mean, definitely, yeah. I like, I've had a taste of league football, and you know, you you, you play at a club that you know you know you're going to fit in. Um, for me, it's, it's not about the fans, but it's it's massive. You know, it does lift you as a player, lifts you as a team on a Saturday. And yeah, no player can say that they don't like support and, and fans. And, you know, thankfully, wherever I've gone, I've, I've actually had very good support. Um, and yeah, I'm very honoured and very blessed to have that because, you know, I haven't given anyone, you know, the, the option to call me a bad egg because I'm not. Um, I'll always work hard for the team. Um, every manager that I've gone to has said that. Um, so yeah, no, like you said, it, the fans there, from what I saw Saturday as well, they're brilliant. Um, the way they get behind the team, you know, they don't stop making noise and yeah, it does really lift the team and, and an individual on the pitch. Yeah, we talk about more the team. Um, we're of course in the playoff places at the moment and got a real good chance of ending the season in the playoff places. We go to Slough Saturday, which is of course a tough game. What test are you expecting? I played at Slough away this year with Hemel and they were very good, very organised team. Um, they've made that place a fortress. Um, but you can see with the form that we're in that we can go to any club and win. So it doesn't matter. We have to just concentrate on ourselves and what we're doing. Um, the boys have been fantastic. So, you know, for me to come in and, and try and help and, and hopefully help the team push on for this crucial period of the season, then, you know, I'm very happy to do that. And, you know, I'll add what I can um, and hopefully goals, which I do score. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, other than that, it's, yeah, it is, it is a fantastic club to come to at this point of the season. You know, I didn't have a bad start. I've had a very good start to the season. Unfortunately, things didn't work out. But yeah, I want to carry it on in a team that is going in the right direction, which Dartford are. Yeah, just speaking, you've, you've only been here a week and it sounds like you're, you're already confident that we're, we're going to go places as a side. Is that the vibe that that camp and the management are creating here at Dartford? Definitely, definitely. Like I can feel it as soon as I come in. Like You've got players that have played pro in there, so they know what it's like and they know what they want. So, yeah, I'm feeling the same vibe as them and especially King E, the manager, he, when I spoke to him, he, he sold me everything that I wanted to hear in terms of the way that where he wants to go and where he wants to take the club. So, yeah, it was a, it was a no-brainer really for me at this point of the season. Cool. Thanks for your time, Liv. Thank you.